Joe Blanchard. Uh, got a 1959 uh, Willis pickup truck. Uh, which is considered a Jeep or Willis. It was called Willis before it was uh, Jeeps. What all did you do? Did you get it already restored or did you do a lot of the work on it yourself? Uh, I bought it uh, nine years ago uh, from old boy and it was green and white. And the truck was in pretty good, decent shape. Uh, took it all apart and uh, kept throwing colors around. I didn't know if I wanted to paint it blue or green. And uh, I mean, blue or white. And when I uh, got done with it, the truck was green and white. So everything that's blue on the truck was green and everything that's silver was uh, white. And everybody said the colors wasn't gonna look good. But now everybody comes back and says, I couldn't have done better on the color. It looks great. Especially Thank with you. the matching rims and yes. everything, or wheels. Um, what engine does this have in it? This is uh, called a, a Super Hurricane. It's made by Continental. Uh, uh, they the one that made the motors for uh, Willis back in the time. So the Hurricane was the four cylinder, and the Super Hurricane was the six? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. Yeah, correct. Um, is it a flathead engine? Yes, oh, it's, wow. yes, it's a flathead. I always wanted old flathead, and that's why I bought the old truck. Uh, what's what did you? Uh, how hard was it to find parts for this thing? At first, it was really extremely hard, and thank God for the internet these days. You can. Uh, I found his website, Kaiser Willis, and I went in there and I found a lot of parts I needed there, and there was some parts that didn't make new. Uh, I found a guy in Indiana, uh, Midwest uh, Willis, and he buys old Willis vehicles, and he had all the parts uh, for it. And actually, I drove up to his place just to go see and spent the whole day with him just buying parts and came back and that was that was probably the end of my list there I had a few not, uh, odds and end things I needed to buy after that oh do you have any plans to do anything else to it in the future or is it just gonna stay you know as I, I have a trailer that I'm redoing that's gonna go behind an old military trailer. So it'll look, it'll match the, the vintage look of it? Yes sir, it, yeah, it'll match the vintage look of the truck. And I also have a car hauling trailer I just bought recently. The, when I go to car shows, it's too far for me to drive. Yeah. I load it on that car and it matches the uh, truck. Um, what's your favorite thing about owning this truck? It's, I love talking to people and I drive it to the store and I live two minutes from the store and it takes me 20 minutes to go get a loaf of bread. Because <laughs> I ain't, they ain't been one time I didn't take this truck out and someone didn't want to stop talking about it or take a picture of it. So if I don't have time to talk, I don't take the truck out. <laughs>